Hello everyone, welcome to another video. Today, I'm going to be doing another food related thing. Um, I teased it in the previous video, but as you can see, I've got some cereal. And, um, well, I, I like cereal quite a lot. You know, it's a good food, very enjoyable to eat and, you know, look at, I guess. <laughs> um, I've also got some milk and a big bowl. And I am very hungry. In fact, I haven't had much to eat today. Um, just because I've been waiting to record this video. But basically, the other day uh, I was having my breakfast and there wasn't quite enough cereal in one of the packs to. They just started to drill. Why the fuck did they start to drill? So basically, a few days ago, me and my mum, or my stepmum, were coming up with video ideas, and I was having breakfast, and there wasn't quite enough room in... Uh, there wasn't quite enough cereal in one of the boxes for, like, a full bowl. You know, that always happens, and it's pretty annoying. And Basically, I was really hungry, so what I did was I took some other cereal. I think it was like Cookie Crisp and Frosties. Um, and I mixed them together and I enjoyed it and I wondered, hmm, I've done quite a few vi mixing videos. Maybe it could be fun to do it on a bit of a larger scale. Which is why I got these. I got some Corn Flakes and Rice Krispies, two different kinds, uh, some Frosties and some Cocoa Pops. Let's see how this goes, because it, it's either going to be really good or really bad. Probably really good, because I like cereal. Um, so I'm going to open these and get annoyed by a cat. I don't know why whenever I'm coming up with video ideas, it always just turns out into me eating food or mixing foods. There's a lot of food video, and I don't know why. It's probably because I enjoy eating. So, um... I think it's about time we did something like this. I've got another video planned where I see what the best milk substitute is. I want to get a bunch of different liquids, uh, some that I think could be good, like milkshake flavours, but some less enjoyable ones, such as sweet and sour sauce, and just experimenting with that. But, um, yeah, I think that's a bit of enough of a tangent. See, big words. I'm going to move these because I think they're just doubles of flavours that we've already got. Uh, I've just opened them, uh, just because I didn't want to have to listen to the rustling of that, because, like, that is always an annoying sound. So, um, yeah, I don't know what's it I'm going to go for first. I think I might just do some cornflakes, you know, I won't be too extreme. Um, is it going to come out? Probably not. Now, the reason this video is in a bit of an awkward situation for me at the moment is because I got very distracted. Um, Frosties, just adding that in now, you probably won't be able to tell much of a difference. So here's the first mix, we've got some Frosties and uh, Corn Flakes. Now, this is something that I've done a couple of times, just to make the cereals last longer. Because um, I eat a lot of cereal. And you know, I do like plain cornflakes, but sometimes it's best to mix it up with some frosting. So, yeah. Basically, I, I got a bit distracted while speaking with someone on an Instagram live. Really awesome. Uh, they do, uh, not cosplay, but they like make cosplay props and things. Now we're doing some Rice Krispies multi-grain shapes. These aren't like normal uh, Rice Krispies. You see they have all these different shapes and things. Um, they taste a bit different from regular Rice Krispies as well. There's like a fish and a tree and a star or starfish or whatever you want to say. However, yeah, um, enough about me getting distracted with cereals. So basically I was talking to them for a while on an Instagram live, they're really cool. Uh, they do some really nice props. Um, 
go check them out. I'll leave their Instagram on the screen somewhere. They are armor merchant. Merchant armor, something like that. Again, back to the main thing. Cereal in a bowl, you know. It's a very big bowl already. I, I could probably get away with just doing half. But you know, what's wrong with getting type 18 diabetes? So, um, yeah, basically, I was talking with them, just having a good time in their live. Go check them out. Uh, we, we were making a bunch of jokes and stuff, laughing about uh, just a bunch of different things. Australian comedy, because they're Australian. Uh, someone, Kim Blake Wilson, who does quite a lot of. Uh, you, I wouldn't recommend watching it if you don't have a good sense of humour, but. You know, he does quite a few uh, funny things, stand up and stuff. You know, it's not very hard, but he does better stand up than me. Get it? Because I can't stand up. Um, yeah, basically, talking to them for quite a while and just chilling. And I said, oh, right, I'd, I'd probably best go just to deal with uh, YouTube and, you know, record this video. However, he said, oh, you know, why don't you plug your channel, you seem really nice, you know, like, he's a nice guy. Um, just mixing it up now, the cereal, I mean. So, yeah, he said that I could plug my channel, and I did. I described what, is, what my channel was. However, I failed at spelling it the first few times, and I said, one or is anus, and no. Honor is annual, honoris, annual, and then honoris annus. And then when he read my name, you know, when he found out what my name really was on YouTube, he, we, we were just laughing. And why does the plane have to go overhead now? He's, oh, cool, yeah. No, this is not a big pool of cereal for you. Um... So yeah, basically, the, uh, we were just laughing at my channel name, because it's funny, Arnus, it's funny, ha <laughs> ha ha, sounds like anus, um, but we, <laughs> he said that it sounds like you're trying to protect your anus, <laughs> like honour the anus, and I think it's just a good idea. You know, protect protect the arts. Sounds like you're doing something. Uh, I advise for sexual uh, worker. Um, I feel like I'm a bit distracted again. Uh, bowl of cereal. It doesn't look very good um, from the side, but it looks pretty good from the top. I don't know why I tried to get that to you to have a look at. I'm a fucking idiot. But yeah, cereal. It looks good, and I'm gonna try it because. I'm stupid and hungry. That was very interesting. Because it, it didn't really taste of a specific cereal. It wasn't bad, by the way. I'm going to finish this entire book back. Because it is good food. I, I, yeah, I eat a lot of cereal. It's good. Um, however, I didn't put as much Rice Krispies or Cocoa Pops in, there's still like half a bowl or half a box there. But I can taste them quite a lot, which says something about that. I also think these uh, multigrain shapes don't help, they add a little bit of flavour, because they're good. But yeah, this is weirdly good. Everything's gone quite soggy already, I don't know how long I've been talking. Normally it doesn't take me this long to eat a bowl of silver and compare this. Um, however, yeah, go check out Merchant Armourer, this was me trying out mixed cereals, I don't know what the plan for this video was, or if I thought this was going to be entertaining, um, but this is definitely not bad, and I think Kellogg's should go into making mixed boxes of cereal, you know, just doing what I've done, where they take some of these 
cereal things, you know, these, and just pour them into a massive thing together and then sell it because this is good and it could help with waste, you know. I should work at Kellogg's because I just came up with that idea. Yeah, that's going to be it for today's video. I learned something about myself. Um, I learned that I enjoy cereal. I think my cat wants to try some. It's not for you. Um, so yeah, I think I'm going to end this video here. If you enjoyed, please leave a like, subscribe, all of that usual stuff. Um, I don't know what the plan for this video was. It's just something stupid. I am looking forward to doing that uh, other video I said with the best milk substitute because I think that's going to be funny. Yeah, if you enjoyed, please leave a like, subscribe, all of that usual stuff. I'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching and goodbye. So, uh, as I'm eating this, you know, th this is after recording, I just decided that I was going to finish it because it's good. Um, but I realised that the milk has started to just turn brown. Like, it's taken a while for the cocoa pops to do anything. Probably because I used like half a jug of this. Um, it says a lot of milk. A lot of the white stuff. Um, yeah, actually, you buy this one.